to the latest video on social media platform today. Uh, a Yoruba man said Sunday, Ibo, we never succeed or do the one nation. He released some statement in the video while speaking in a native language that Sunday Bo will never succeed or do the one nation. According to the trans, uh, translation of his statement in English, he said there are some misinformation going everywhere that people need to take note of. He said there are reports that Hausa people are going to abroad to study while Yoruba people are going there to become slaves. In his statement, he said, it's important to note that every tribe are benefiting from one another in everything. I think that after this video, a lot of insults, threats, and causes will follow up. It's not as if I am not scared, but when you see the truth, we need to speak the truth to ourselves. It is very important for us to remind ourselves that it's outside people that are planting pepper, onions, and others. But it's Yoruba people, but Yoruba people that are eating them. Likewise, it's Yoruba people that are planting cola, bitter cola, and it's Hausa that are eating them too. The Igbos produce palm oil, and it's Yoruba that are consuming it. It's everybody that's in need of one another. According to more statements, he talked about the ongoing talk on the borders that people are saying it's Hausa that dominates the place. He said nobody should say what he or she does not know. He talks about the Lagos Ibadan Road that was constructed by Buhari was better than the one former President Gulag Jonathan did on Kaduna Abuja Road. He also said for that that all Yorubas have to agree as one before we can talk about breaking out of Nigeria. He said the Yoruba have not come together to agree as one on where the headquarters will be, who are those that will be the security. He said also that it is sentiment that will happen at the end of the day. He stated that if at the end of the day, Yoruba break out of Nigeria, that Yoruba will all end up killing themselves. Do you know how long it takes for people that fought for independence in 1960 to, to got it? You can never succeed without unity. And if at the end you did not succeed with all this agitation, it will later turn into political problem because it's already looking like one. During Ensa's protest, Sunday Igbo was not there, but when it is time for Yoruba Nation, you are expecting Lagos people to join you. It's asking a question. The population of Lagos is bigger than that of Ogun, or Shun Ekiti, or your state. We are more than 22 million in Lagos. Is Aosa that is cutting nails for us. They are the ones carrying load in the market. Is Aosa that is digging where and sink uh, suck away. If a child falls inside river, is Aosa you will call upon to rescue. Is Aosa that is there where they are uh, changing dollars. We can't succeed without unity. Let's wise up. People are insulting Sunday Bowl, but I cannot do that. But he needs to be enlightened. You can't use a uh, talk dream manner to get it. During Awolowo time, it was a round table discussion. They never used talk dream to get what they want. Who is Sunday Boo? Sunday Boo is a businessman. And I don't, I, I can't warn him because he is an elderly person. But I would like to say one or two things about you. When the troubles come, people that started it will never stay. He said everybody is fighting for his own, including Sunday Bo, who is a PDP member. He mentioned uh, Madu, Madakeke war. He said it's nothing 
compared to fighting a whole nation. On the note, he said, Yoruba people agitating for the one nation should think twice, though. He urged them to embrace one uh, one another before it's, before, okay, be it any tribe. He talked about the long, ongoing Biafra agitation that has been happening for a long time without achieving it. He said also that how can Sunday Bo and others just wake up one day that they want to open all borders and break out of Nigeria? And that is why people are calling him illiterate. He mentioned also that how many houses of Hausa that are in Lagos compared to the houses and properties that Yoruba people have in the north. He hyped he, Hausa that there are people who are contented with whatever they are doing that how many hours are into yahoo yahoo compared to yoruba people he said yoruba can manage any business so to survive but yoruba are always in a hurry to become great you understand and this one can cause many reactions you know people call they talk go here and there some people call even they call her names for years saying a fool that you not know waiting in the talk why some are saying that this is the right thing you know, that the guy have just said the mind of many the minds of many that you cannot just wake up one day to come and declare a nation that uh, if you can uh, recall what is happening now in the southeast the biafran nation that being on on all the way for a long time now they've not still achieved it and so many persons have still died inside the matter. Why some can they talk say Sunday Bo will soon end up in a Nigerian prison? Now that time, those people when they clap for her, go come no. So hello guys, I'm gonna drop it here. What do you have to say about this? What do you think about what this guy have just said? And Sunday Bo, then the Oduduwa Nation. Let's hear from you. Kindly hit the comment section. And don't forget to uh, subscribe to this channel if you have not. Also, give us thumbs up. Thank you very much for stopping by. Bye for now.